Hi everybody, this video will show you how to connect a third party device in Wii's setup and how to control the Wii's light with any third party device say Google Home in this case. Please keep it in mind that the light Google Home and the app are in the same network. Please make sure that your light is paired in the Wiz app and can be controllable. So if I turn off and on, the light is getting turned and on and off. Next, you have to go to the setting of Wiz app and then come down to integration, click Google Home. First unlink it if it is already linked and then relink it. It will generate a code. Next, go to Google Home. So in the in Google Home, I the I have a My Home, and then I have to add this Wiz lamp in my room. The Google Home is already added in my room, so make sure that your home is already added in. In the home setup, press the plus connection, set up a device. Please note that you have to press work with Google, this option. Then it will show the accounts that you can manage with. So you have to go to Wiz, agree and link. Please remember that you have to create an account in the Wiz and also you also have an account in Google Home and then the setup can only be done in that way. So you, it is Google Home is linking with Wiz account. Now you can see there are many devices which Google Home is has identified and one of it is A70 20, 12 watt bulb. This is A70 12 volt bulb of Wiz Mac. So I want to add it to my home and then add to move this device to my room. So you can see You can see in this device is added in my room. Now I will give you a, give Google Home a voice command and check whether it is functioning or not. Hey Google, turn off the light in my room. Hey Google, turn on the light in my room. So Google has, Home has identified the light and I can control this light using Google Home. Next, I want to show you that once you have uh, uh, the setup uh, using Google Home, you can also control the light with Wiz app. If I press on and off, the lights are getting controlled by Wiz mode. So there are three ways currently you can control the light. One with the help of Wiz app. Next with the help of Wiz mode. And third with the help of Google Home. Hey Google, turn off the light. Hey Google, turn on the light. Hey Google, change the color of the light to cool white in my room. Sorry, I'm not sure how to help. Hey Google, change the color to cool white of my room. Hey Google, 
change the color of the light to cool white so it has hey google dim the light hey google dim the light to 50% so it is doing everything as per the user command hey google change the brightness to 100% now there is an event of power failure in case of power failure the google home is off light is already off and the network is also gone so i do not have any connectivity in the setup the light icon will slowly go away next the power is restored once the power restores google home will start the network will start so is the control of this light will be established at the moment i have not changed anything neither i have tried to do any kind of pairing i am allowing few seconds to reestablish the network connection and then i will check with every controlling device to check the functionality of the light so the google home is reestablished first i will check with the app yes the app can do whatever you want to do even after the uh, power outage has happened and the user has not done any change next is wiz mode yes it is functioning as usual and then finally with google home hey google turn off the light in my room hey google turn on the light in my room so you have seen how power outage has not affected the control mechanism of this light in any way you can control the light with app you can control the light with wiz mode you can control the light with your voice assistant in this video we have demonstrated two things how to connect to a third party assistance device and how to control the light with it and also in case of power fa failure how to reestablish the connection without do anything thank you